hands there? You were far less. You were in good hands. I'm kind of like Allstate, but for hair. <laughs> Make me a brunette. What? Brunette? <laughs> Honey, you're a genetic lotto win. All right. Something else is clearly going on here. Let me see. Mm -hmm. Back up. Four left listening. Spill. Oh, okay. I know, Lutz. I came all the way out here for Harvard Law School. That's a good school. I know, right? <laughs> and I said to all my rich beloved Warner out here, and now he's, he's dating this evil preppy. So what's she got that you don't got? Three tits? She's serious. Seriously, she got three tits? No. <laughs> She's a constipated polo dress with a mousy brown mop. Well, apparently, that's what Warner wants, so you need to make me brunette. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Do you know the number one reason behind all bad hair decisions? Love. You're lost without your love. Your heart is on the floor. I can help you. I've been there before when I need to relax. I just put on some tracks from this CD I bought for the store. Isn't that relaxing? It's called Celtic Moss. <laughs> See, my mom was three quarters Italian, and my father, I never knew it. But my grandfather came from Ireland, the land where dreams come true. Ireland, Ireland. <laughs> he said all Irish men are like heroes. They're descended from poets and kings. So I swore I'd get married in Ireland in a wedding like Lord of the
Next Friday at 8, 243 Mass Ave. See you there. Thanks, Vivian. Oh, you are so borrowing my secret weapon costume I got in storage, Elle. I'll just dust the moth balls off and hope when you see it. Now you go and you do this, honey. If a girl like you can't win that command, there's no hope for the rest of us. I keep talking you off the ledge, Paulette. You have no idea how much I hate this. You go, you go, and you fight for him. <laughs>